With many years of paranormal investigating under our belt, there has been some amazing evidence collected from some amazing locations. Many of these locations have not been featured in any video from Four State Paranormal, nor do all of our investigations make it to haunting history. We are opening the vault and bringing you inside some of our most memorable investigations and telling you our story firsthand. So take a trip with us as we explore our haunted past. I'm Dawn, I got into the paranormal because, wait a second, am I supposed to look at you? I got into the paranormal um, when I was a little kid. I used to love scary movies and we would sit around with my parents' neighbors and tell ghost stories all the time. And it just kind of fascinated me thinking about ghosts or there's something else out there. Um, I guess I didn't really think about it like that when I was a little kid, but that's how I got started. Probably movies and stories. Watching Ghost Adventures got me started or got me to where I was interested in investigating. I found um, uh, Four States Paranormal on Facebook one day. There was an ad that was put out um, asking for, or looking for people to interview to maybe join the team. So I filled out an application and then got a call like a month or two later. So I went to meet the team and did an investigation with them on the first night. Um, it was really kind of scary because it's different than what you see on TV. You're really there and you really, you know, something could be there. And, you know, on TV you're just watching it. You're not really a part of it. So it was kind of scary the first night, but it was very interesting because the people had been having experiences with the ghost or, you know, paranormal, whatever they want to call it, but they were having some experiences and it was kind of nice to give them a little relief. So I just kept wanting to do it even more and more after that. It really made me feel good. I mean, to be able to help somebody is the most important thing, especially with something like that, because it can be very dangerous messing with anything like that or if something like that is in your home. So to go in and be able to help somebody, it makes you feel really good. They've been, I felt really good about what we do and um, but like like I was told in the beginning some things will you know could happen to you or to happen to your family and you really don't really think about that kind of stuff until you're in that situation um, so my experiences have been good very educational I've learned a lot um, I still I want to help people but there's different parts of it now that I think people should learn about. So it's not just going in and looking for ghosts. It's, it's really about helping people and letting them know that there's something else out there. And, you know, if you have problems, get help with it fast. The team is my family. Like, uh, if I had any problems or the things that I went through, you guys were there for me and I feel like I could, you know, call you guys and you would be there and we would get through it together, and we did. My goal when I got into um, investigating the paranormal was just to go see if I could, you know, hear voices, catch voices on an EVP or, you know, see a shadow or something. I really didn't know that much about it. So I just wanted to hear and see stuff. And um, now, it's, um, I really want to get it out there that there is something else besides just what you see on TV. It's real, and I, I want people to know that it's real, and it will affect your entire family. My goal would be to be able to talk to the dead, I guess. I mean, silly as that sounds. I would love to be able to communicate, to get messages, you know, from people that have lost loved ones, to talk to them and get a message back to the family. If there's one thing you could tell somebody about it, what would you tell them? If I could tell anybody anything, I would say do your research. Um, make sure that you are protected, that you know how to protect yourself when you're going into something.